गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन हाई आई एम टीचर बाई प्रोफेशन वेलकम टू माई चैनल डिक्शनरी टू डेलीकेसी माई फर्स्ट रेसिपी हियर इज एन इंडियन यूनिवर्सल फेवरेट डेजर्ट लेट्स स्टार्ट this recipe you will need sugar 500 g 6 whole cardamom ghee 500 g 1 gids gulab jamun packet and milk 200 ml we have chosen the gids gulab jamun ready made mix pack which is my mother's favorite and here she is going to guide us first we will warm the milk warm milk is the most important step for making soft gulab jamun cut open the pack and pour the powder mixture onto a plate Take small portion of milk and mix with the powder. Knead gently. cover and keep aside for the sugar syrup take a large vessel to it add 500 g of sugar and 300 ml of water Take 15 ml of milk and add to the boiling syrup. Stir it. After two minutes, you will be able to see white froth layer. With the help of a draining spatula, take them out. In a mortar pestle, make a powder of your whole cardamom. Add this powder to the syrup. we'll go back to the dough which we had kept covered add milk to the dough and knead it firmly Take a small amount of ghee on your palms and make the balls. Pour a generous amount of ghee in a thick bottom pan. Let it heat on high flame for 2 minutes. Lower the flame to medium low and add the gulab jamun balls to it. Stir in between. Fry it for five minutes or until the fried balls turn golden brown. At this time, heat the syrup. Keep it aside. Now 
Once the balls are ready, place them one by one with the help of your fingers from the draining spatula into the warm syrup. After placing all the balls in the syrup, heat the vessel for 5 minutes. Switch off the gas and let it cool for 30 minutes. And our gulab jamun is ready. While serving, top it with your favorite dry fruits. I have added almonds. For an interesting tale behind it and some small personal tips, Check the description box below. Hope you all liked it. Bye everybody.